Hey there, health warriors. It's your favorite straight talking man back with some life saving info. Today, we're diving deep into a topic that could literally be the difference between life and death. We're talking heart attacks. But not just any heart attack talk, we're going to uncover the sneaky signs that could show up a whole month before disaster strikes. Buckle up, because this ride could save your life or someone you love. Before we jump in, smash that like button if you're all about staying healthy, and let's get this vital info to as many people as possible. Ready? Let's go! 1. The chest conspiracy first up, we've got the classic, chest discomfort. But here's the kicker, it's not always that Hollywood heart-clutching drama. Nope, sometimes it's more like a sneaky ninja, creeping in as a mild pressure or tightness. Picture this, you're walking up the stairs, and suddenly it feels like someone's sitting on your chest. Then it's gone. You might think, oh, I'm just out of shape. Wrong. This could be your heart screaming for help. Don't ignore it. If this happens, especially during activity, it's time to have a chat with your doc. Remember, better safe than sorry. 2. The fatigue fiasco next on our hit list, fatigue. But we're not talking about your average I stayed up binge watching tired. This is next level exhaustion. Imagine feeling like you've run a marathon just from doing the dishes. Crazy, right? This extreme fatigue happens because your heart's struggling to pump blood efficiently. It's like trying to water your entire garden with a kinked hose, everything's working over time, and nothing's getting enough. Ladies, listen up. This one's especially sneaky for you. Women often experience fatigue as a primary symptom, so don't brush it off as just being busy or stressed. If simple tasks are wiping you out, it's time to get checked. 3. Breathless betrayal moving on to number 3, shortness of breath. This isn't about being winded after chasing your kid around the park. We're talking struggling to breathe during normal activities or even while you're chilling on the couch. Here's the science behind it, when your heart's not pumping effectively, blood can back up in your lungs. It's like a traffic jam in your chest, and suddenly, getting air feels like breathing through a straw. If you find yourself gasping like a fish out of water for no good reason, don't wait, get it checked out ASAP. 4. The dizzying dilemma alright, let's spin into our next symptom, dizziness or lightheadedness. This one's a real head-turner, pun intended. Picture this, you stand up, and suddenly the room's doing the cha-cha around you. Or maybe you feel like you're about to star in your own fainting scene. This happens because your brain's not getting enough blood flow. It's like your heart's playing a twisted game of keep away with your brain, and trust me, that's one game you don't want to win. If dizziness becomes your new normal, especially with cold sweats, it's time to face the music and see a doctor. Your heart could be trying to tell you something, so listen up. 5. The gut instinct now, here's a curveball for you, indigestion, nausea, or vomiting. Yep, you heard that right. Your upset stomach could actually be a heart problem in disguise. Think about it. You've got this persistent heartburn that no amount of antacids can touch. Or maybe you're feeling queasy for no apparent reason. It's easy to blame the gas station sushi, but your heart might be the real troublemaker here. This happens because when your heart's in distress, it can mess with the nerves connected to your digestive system. It's like your body's playing a weird game of telephone, and the message is getting scrambled. So if your gut's acting up and you can't pinpoint why, especially if it's coupled with other symptoms we've talked about, it's time to consider that your heart might be sending an SOS. 6. The pain game alright, pop quiz, where do you feel heart attack pain? If you said chest, you're only partially right. Truth bomb, heart attack pain is a master of disguise. You might feel discomfort radiating to your arms, especially the left one, your back, neck, jaw, or even your stomach. It's like your body's playing a twisted game of pin the pain on the person. Why? Because the nerves around your heart are connected to these areas. So when your heart's in trouble, it sets off a full body alarm system. Don't fall into the trap of thinking, well, it can't be my heart because the pain's in my arm. Your heart's smarter than that, and now you are too. 7. Sleep sabotage Let's talk sleep, or lack thereof. If you're suddenly tossing and turning all night, your heart might be the hidden puppet master. Imagine this, you're exhausted, but the moment your head hits the pillow, your mind starts racing. Or maybe you fall asleep but wake up feeling like you've been running from zombies all night. This isn't just regular stress, folks. In the weeks leading up to a heart attack, many people report sleep disturbances. Why? 
your body's in a state of high alert. It's like your heart's trying to warn your brain, hey, we've got a problem down here, while you're trying to catch some Z's. If your sleep's gone from sweet dreams to nightmare scenario, especially coupled with anxiety or unusual tiredness, don't sleep on it, get checked out. 8. The swelling situation time for some visible evidence, swelling in your legs, ankles, or feet. This isn't your typical I stood too long at a concert swelling. We're talking persistent puffiness that's making your socks leave indent marks. Here's the deal, when your heart's not pumping effectively, fluid can build up in your body. It's like a backed up plumbing system, and gravity pulls that excess fluid down to your lower extremities. Your body's literally retaining water, but not in a good way. If you notice this swelling, especially if it's getting worse over time, don't just prop your feet up and hope for the best. This could be a red flag that your heart's struggling to keep up. Time to get those feet, and your heart, checked out. 9. Heartbeat havoc last but definitely not least, let's talk about that rhythm in your chest. An irregular heartbeat, or arrhythmia, can be a major warning sign. You know that fluttery feeling in your chest, like your heart's doing the salsa when it should be doing a waltz? Or maybe it feels like it's skipping beats, leaving you wondering if it's taking an unscheduled break. While the occasional flutter is normal, frequent palpitations or a consistently irregular rhythm is your heart's way of waving a big red flag. Think of your heart like a drummer in a band. When it's healthy, it keeps a steady beat. But when something's wrong, it starts missing cues and playing off-tempo. If your heart's suddenly playing jazz when it should be playing pop, it's time to call in the experts. Here is the grand finale, your action plan all right, health champions, we've covered a lot of ground. But knowing is only half the battle. Here's your action plan. 1. Stay vigilant, keep an eye out for these symptoms, especially if you have multiple ones. 2. Don't delay, if you spot these warning signs, don't wait it out. Time is heart muscle, people. 3. Get checked, make that doctor's appointment. A simple checkup could save your life. 4. Spread the word, share this video with your loved ones. You never know whose life you might save. 5. Live heart smart, eat well, stay active, manage stress. Prevention is always better than cure. Remember, your body's always talking to you. With this knowledge, you're now fluent in heart speak. Use it wisely. If this video hit home for you, smash that like button harder than you've ever smashed it before. Subscribe and hit that notification bell because we've got more life-saving content coming your way. And hey, drop a comment telling me which of these symptoms surprised you the most. Stay healthy, stay informed, and keep that heart pumping strong. See you in the next one, where we'll tackle more ways to keep you living your best, healthiest life. Bye.